Okay. Uh, so as said, the talk will be about uh, security mechanisms for wireless sensor networks, and I would like to talk about this because, uh, well, security is often a, a little bit neglected in the uh, environment of wireless sensor networks, and uh, I will show that it's actually an important thing to look at, and uh, what I want to do is as well to show a little bit uh, what kind of... Uh, uh, research and uh, mechanisms are actually required and uh, what we should look at. So I'd like to start with uh, an example application that uh, that picture here is taken uh, well in, in Portugal, so not uh, too far from here. That's uh, an oil refinery in Sinish, Portugal. And uh, we had there uh, a research project about uh, process automation and control. And to give you an idea about uh, why security uh, is important, I think this is a kind of nice example. So in such a refinery, which are quite large, so it's a dimension of a city, so you need to get uh, buses to go around there. Uh, and what they have there is uh, something about 35,000 sensors. Yeah? So it's quite a lot, of, uh, a lot of sensing, a large sensor network. And uh, at the moment, these are wired, but uh, potentially in the future, these will be uh, wireless systems. And when you think about such a scenario, then uh, you cannot neglect uh, something like security anymore. Okay? And there are two main reasons for that. Uh, one of it is, uh, well, safety. So you don't want to have uh, an intruder uh, messing around with your network because uh, that can have, in, in such a case, uh, serious implications. So a malfunction in these systems uh, can eventually lead to something like an explosion or big oil spill. Uh, things like that. So to operate such a system uh, of such significance, you, you need to look at uh, security and uh, have to implement security mechanisms. So besides this uh, safety and uh, uh, avoiding that someone tinkers with your system, uh, you have as well some business considerations. So for example, uh, as you can see here, you have big uh, storage tanks and uh, they contain oil, and depending on how much is in there, you can, uh, you can for example, infer uh, how prices might develop. So an attacker might actually try to read sensor data to get an idea about uh, how much oil of which type is being kept. So what I try to, uh, to show you is that for, for any serious application that you may run for safety and as well uh, to protect your commercial interests, uh, you have to look at uh, security and you can't ignore that uh, in these systems. So to look at what, uh, what security actually means in that, uh, in, in that area, well, you have the basic